What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and today I am doing my AEW Revolution 2022 predictions video. The show is on Sunday, March the 6th. However, I'm filming it on the Friday beforehand, before the Go Home Rampage. So any matches that will be added on that show, if there are any, I will add in the description down below along with my predictions. So without further ado, let's get right into my Revolution predictions video. The first match I have on the card is the face of the Revolution ladder match where the winner receives an opportunity for Sammy Guevara's TNT Championship. The participants are as follows. We've got Wardlow versus Keith Lee versus Powerhouse Hobbs versus Orange Cassidy versus Ricky Starks for this match. And hopefully, hopefully, it's going to be one of two people, in my opinion. I think it's either going to be Wardlow or it's going to be Keith Lee. Now, I'd quite like to see Keith Lee win, uh, but I think AEW are really starting to do a slow build of uh, having Wardlow be an almost Batista character. Eventually, he is going to turn on Sean Spears and MJF and become a big baby face. I think that Sean Spears could cost Wardlow the match here, uh, which may tip him over the edge and we may get it at Revolution. But uh, yeah, I, I don't think Wardlow's going to win, but I'll be impressed if he does. So my prediction is Keith Lee. The next match on the card is a six-man tag team match between Matt Hardy, Andrade El Idolo, and Isaiah Cassidy versus Sting, Darby Allen, and the TNT champion Sammy Guevara. Now, I automatically, straight away, am predicting Sting, Darby, and Sammy to win. Uh, obviously, Matt Hardy is getting more and more fed up recently. I think this is going to be his breaking point where he walks out and uh, yeah, goes and teams with a debuting Jeff Hardy in the future. I think Matt Hardy's going to separate himself now and uh, walk away, be singles for a little while, and then when Jeff comes back, reform the Hardy Boys. So I've got Sammy, Sting, and Darby going over for the win. Next up on the card is Chris Jericho versus Eddie. Kingston. Now, obviously, Jericho's inner circle has been falling to pieces in the last few weeks. I think that's going to culminate here with Jericho losing to Eddie Kingston. However, this match really could go either way. Next up is a match that I am really, really excited for. It is the American Dragon, Brian Danielson versus John Moxley. Now, Brian Danielson has been trying to get Moxley to team with him. Uh, instead, they're going to have a match. Someone's going to bleed. I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm predicting Brian Danielson to beat John Moxley. And then hopefully these two can actually team as I really want to see that happen. Coming up next, we have that absolute snake MJF Maxwell Jacob Friedman taking on CM Punk in a dog collar match. Now we all we were all reeled in by MJF with his sympathy act before he then turned on Punk last week on Dynamite or the other night on Dynamite I should say, kicking him in the nuts and then leaving him in a bloody mess. I want to see the retribution. I want to see CM Punk take on MJF and beat him to a pulp. But then I want to see MJF beat CM Punk once again, technically. So yeah, I think that would do wonders for MJF's career. And I really hope that he moves into the AEW world title picture after this feud. I think MJF's going to win. Moving into the championship matches now, first off with the TBS championship, Jade Cargill, the champion taking on Take On Tie. She's been undefeated. I don't see that changing. Not going to spend too long on it. Jade Cargill is going to retain. This next championship match is going to be a banger. We have the Young Bucks versus Red Dragon, Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish versus the champions, Jurassic Express for the AEW Tag team championships who do i think's gonna win i am going with red dragon to become the new aew tag team champions i can't wait for this match there's definitely going to be a big blow up between the young bucks and red dragon i just can't wait to see it and hopefully red dragon become the new champions the next match is for the AEW Women's Championship. It is the champion Dr. Britt Baker defending against Thunder Rosa. Now, I think, normally I would just say Britt Baker, but genuinely this time round, I think that Britt Baker is going to be dropping the championship and Thunder Rosa is going to become the new AEW Women's Champion. So there you go. I'm not going with the doctor. 
I am predicting Thunder Rosa to win the title. And finally, in the main event for the AEW World Championship, the champion hangman Adam Page defends against Adam Cole, baby. And oh my God, am I excited for this match. I think there is definitely going to be Red Dragon interference. There's definitely going to be shenanigans. But at the end of the day, I just can't see Adam Cole winning the AEW World Championship right now, uh, especially not from Adam Page, as we've seen the punishment he has, he will go through to retain that championship. I don't think that there is anything Adam Cole can do to him to beat him for the championship right now. So with that being said, I am predicting Hangman Adam Page to walk out of Revolution still the AEW World Champion. But there you go. That was my AEW Revolution 2022 predictions video. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I won't be reacting to it live, but I'm hoping to catch the show early the next morning. So if anything big does happen, uh, I will be getting my reaction videos out the next day instead. But anyway, I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Tell me your predictions in the comment section down below. Like, comment and subscribe and I will see you at Revolution. Goodbye. Burn it!